Hello friend, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, in this video, I will show you how to mount the NTFS file system on CentOS 7. As we know, the Windows operating system uses NTFS for partitioning uh, large hard disk drives. But, we, but when we access these uh, drives on Linux system, by default, they are not accessible. For this, we require NTFS 3G. We require this package, NTFS 3G, to be installed on CentOS 7 for mounting a NTFS drive on uh, this CentOS system or on a Linux machines. For this, we need EPL repositories to install these packages. So as of now, as of now, I don't have internet access on this uh, system. So I'm doing the, all these things offline. I already downloaded packages required for NTFS 3G. These are the three packages which is required for uh, mounting the NTFS file system. So let's start and install these uh, packages on the system and then later we check and how we can uh, mount the NTFS file system and access the NTFS disk on this system. So let's start. For this, let's install these all three RPMs one by one. All right, our packages are successfully installed. Okay, now it's not showing here. All right, no issues. The next thing is we need to load the fuse driver uh, by default the fuse is installed on this system even you can check as I was saying this uh, fuse package is already installed and it's having the latest version so by default on CentOS 7 this package is already installed so re we require this fuse package as well with the NTFS 3G so let's uh, let's uh, load this fuse driver by using the mod prob command mod prob and then fuse in this way you can load the fuse driver all right now let's check right now on this system no ntfs disk or drive is attached so let me uh, attach my pen drive on this uh, system that pen drive is having the NTFS uh, file system. So let me uh, mount the pen drive. As you can see, I have just attached my pen drive having 4 GB of space on this pen drive and it's having the NTFS partition okay to check the NTFS partition we can run command like fdisk hyphen l and then grab NTFS as you can see this disk or partition is having the NTFS file system all right next thing is 
let's mount this uh, partition on our local directory so let's create one directory or we can mount it on empty folder for this run command mount hyphen t type it's ntfs then dev sdb1 slash mnt right as you can see this file system is successfully mounted on mnt let's check the contents of uh, this disk as you can see that i am able to see the contents of ntfs disk so in this way you can mount the ntfs file system on cento 7 let's try to uh, add some content on this drive let me copy this rpm on pen drive as you can see that i am able to write data on this uh, ntfs disk so in this way you can uh, mount the file system on CentOS 7 so that's all in this video if you like this video then please like and subscribe my channel thanks and have a good day